So let's get started with Nala. Blossom, last night the enchanted hearts started to glow. Mm. It's time to close those rifts once and for all. Are you ready? Let's do this. Based on that memory we uncovered in Pride Rock, we need to put these enchanted hearts inside the lioness statues. But I don't remember how. Ugh. Why doesn't any of this make sense to me? At least we can be confused together. <laughs> That's true. All this magic stuff still bewilders me. All the more reason to find somebody else who understands it. Let's talk to Ursula. Uh -huh. That's right. We left those old lioness statues with her. Maybe she's had some time to figure out how they work. I'll keep watch over the rifts and try to catch fish for the others while you talk to her. Alright, so let's go talk to Ursula. We're going to do... Oh, here you are. Ursula, we need your help. We've got these enchanted hearts, but we don't know what we need to do next. Well, it's about time you came to see me, dearie. I've had about enough of these pesky fish and all this mystical nonsense clogging up the village waterways. Uh. <laughs> but luckily for you, I figured out exactly how to set things right. Really? How? Yes. It's simple enough. Now listen closely, Blossom. I don't want to have to repeat myself. To make new line of statues, you'll need to find clay and sand. Then, to focus the magic, each statue will need a gemstone embedded in its forehead. A gemstone from the place where each rift opened. The rifts opened on Dazzle Beach, Glade of Trust, and Frosted Heights. Oh. <laughs> An aquamarine, amethyst, and citrine ought to do it then. Uh -huh. Finally, you'll need to craft the lioness statues and place them near each rift to ensure it closes. <laughs> Best of luck, angelfish. Hope it's not too much for you. Oh, someone's on a roll. Okay, so it's letting me use this stuff already. So let's make that one. Okay. Decorate by placing the lioness statues with the correct gemstones next to the rifts in Dazzle Beach. Alright. Alright, so let's go to Frosted Heights. Fast travel to the glade and place this one next to the rift. All right, let's talk to Nala. You put the lioness statues down by the rifts. I just hope this works. Me too. Huh? Wait. Ha. My whiskers are twitching again, just like they did when the rifts opened ha. up. Ha. Do you feel that? I feel uh -huh. something. It's so strong, I can feel it tingling in my paws. Hmm. I, I think it's the rifts closing. Did you see those flashes of lights in the distance? Yeah. And that awful smell Ooh. is gone. I think it's really <laughs> over, Blossom. We sealed the rifts for, the good, for good this time. Huh? Oh, hold on. There's a new smell. Those fish that swam through the rifts are still here. Huh? But they're different somehow. They smell like regular fish. Real fish. <laughs> and they smell kind of delicious. You want to eat them? Maybe we're just hungry, but I agree. I guess we won't know until we try it. I'll catch some of the fish and bring them to Remy to see if they can be made into anything edible. Though I bet those fish don't like warm water very much. I probably need to wait until it's a little cooler to catch them. So that means I shouldn't try and catch them now? It's too warm because it's the middle of the day? Maybe if I try fishing in the morning or in the evening when the sun's not as high in the sky. 
Okay, so when the sun, so like, twilight time? So does that mean I'm gonna have to come back later? Catch a here and there fish by fishing anywhere in the village in the morning or evening. Okay, it's still kind of morning right now, but I bet you it's probably too late because it's closer to lunchtime. But we'll try it. Okay, let's try again. We'll fish these few things, and if not, um, I'll come back later. Okay. So, let's see. One more time. Okay, so I'm assuming that I must come back later and I will just stitch it into this video right here instead of doing two parts um, and we will catch the here and there fish try to this evening I'll probably try around six or seven I guess right before it gets dark okay we are back it is about 7 30 my time right now and since it said catch here and there fish by fishing anywhere in the village in the morning or evening so earlier today in the other part of this video um, it was about 11 and I tried to catch the here and there fish and there was no way I could catch it there was nothing so let's try now. Alright guys, I sped up that last clip because it did take about 30 minutes of fishing to get our creepy looking here and there fish. So this is what our here and there fish looks like. Alright, so now once you have the fish, we have to take it to Remy. Whoa, is that the fish that kept disappearing on us? It's not glowing anymore. What happened? It came from the here and there. We're wondering what to do with it. Can you make a meal out of it? If it's edible, I can make a meal out of it. Let me just try a tiny bite to be sure. Hmm. This fish, it tastes... It tastes... The suspense <coughs> is killing me. It's delicious. Lightly sweet, salty, and with just a bit of tangy acidity. Mm. I know exactly how I'm going to serve this. A nice, slow simmering stew with tomatoes, mushrooms, and maybe a dash of oregano. Alright, so those are italicized, so we probably need tomatoes, mushrooms, and oregano. Wait, it was Nala's idea to try eating this fish in the first place. If it weren't for her, this whole village might have gotten sucked into the here and there. Why don't I make this meal for Nala first? Mm. That'd be perfect, Blossom. <laughs> and we should name it in her honor. Here, 
take a recipe, one lioness feasts for Nala. May with extra appreciation for the protector of the valley. Okay, so let's drop something. We work well as a team. Alright, so let's use our recipe. You need the here and there fish, mushrooms, tomato, and oregano. Alright, let's make our feast for Nala. Surprise Nala with the lioness feast to celebrate. And another little hack. If you have them working with you or hanging out with you while you are working on the quest, it's easy to find them. <laughs> what is this? It smells amazing. This is made with the fish from the here and there. Remy gave me a recipe. We thought you should have it first. To celebrate Nala, the protector of Dreamlight Valley. I really don't know what to say. I'm glad I can help you feed your pride, Blossom, and keep the valley safe. You're part of my pride, Nala, so it's time to dig in and eat. Let's try it. It smells so good. That was delicious. I was so worried that because of me, the whole valley was going to get destroyed or that everyone would go hungry. But now it's safe and we have more food than ever. You're just what this village needed, Nala. Thank you, Blossom. I can't tell you how much that means to me. And to show you how much I appreciate your help, I asked Scrooge McDuck to make a special place for you. It's an oasis for the valley, something everyone can use. That's gorgeous. I wonder what sort of special ingredients grow. Alright. That completes Nala's last quest. 